January 6, 2021. In the middle of a pandemic. Breaking news. The first death from coronavirus here in the United States. It would kill one million Americans. A sitting president sent his supporters to stop the certification of the election he had lost. Let them get out. Let, let the weak ones get out. This is a time for strength. And we got to get rid of the weak Congress people, the ones that aren't any good. His supporters invaded the Capitol, erecting gallows to kill the vice president, threatening to kill the Speaker of the House, and smearing the halls of Congress with their own feces. I'd uh, like to read a few poems from my latest collection, Buried Seeds. I know the pain, the fear, the anger you must be feeling. Just another day, just another African-American lying dead on the streets, beaten. Mama, mama. Yeah. Mama choked. Mama, one of the front pouches. Mama, on my right. Shot, tased. You would leave America. America left me a long time ago. They'll come for you now. I know. And why? Why stay? Because if they win here, they win everywhere. Your poetry won't protect you. Good Americans. It's the story of America. It's the story of us. Pissing poetry against infinity and futility, against majorities and minorities who suffer the majority of the time. Swiping poetry on my phone, freestyling on a Motorola like an electronic Crayola. Pissing words, bleeding words, hating words, wishing for the stink of ink instead of urine. Wishing for meaning and power and wondering what kind of stupid fucking sword could fail to cut the words off, to slice the fucking pen no one uses anymore. Pissing poetry and bleeding love and hope and life. Fuck poetry. Piss on poetry with poetry and shit words like turds. Fuck, 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 fuck. Pissing poetry against a concrete fucking wall. <laughs>